may look like a tiny little trade, doesn't really matter, doesn't mean anything, but let me tell you, Howie Roseman is at it again. He just made a sneaky good trade that everybody should be happy with. What a, what a, what a move by Howie Roseman, whoa! Dallas still stinks. You made the f***ing thing back here and guess what, guess what? Howie Roseman's at it again. He's at it again. The guy does not take a day off. Ever. Ever. We had one preseason game and the Eagles have already made a trade, okay? So here's what's happening. Here's what's breaking now. The Eagles trade offensive tackle Ryan Bates, who was an undrafted free agent from Penn State, who I really liked that signing when they did it. They trade him to the Buffalo Bills, and in return, they get defensive end Eli Harold. Now, Eli Harold, I think he was drafted in the third round in 2015. He was with the 49ers uh, for like three years, I, I want to say. Last year, he was traded to the Detroit Lions, became a free agent after last season, signs with the Buffalo Bills in April, and now he was stuck way back in the depth chart, and he's being shipped to Philly with the Eagles. So the Eagles are bringing in another defensive end to really beef up that depth on that team. I really like this trade. I really like this trade. I think this is a sneaky good trade for the Eagles, okay? Eli Harold is 25 years old. He had four sacks in 13 games with the Detroit Lions last year. Before that, I think he played like 48, 49 games with the San Francisco 49ers, became a free agent, went to Buffalo, okay? Now he's in Philly, and that experience of him playing, uh, what, three, four years in the league is coming in and is going to compete directly with young guys like Josh Sweat, like Deshaun Hall, and I think this is a good, good thing for the Eagles. I mean, our defense, our defense is predicated on that pass rush. We know it. We know the Eagles have to get the quarterback. They like to rotate guys in, and there is a real fight. There is a real battle for that fourth defensive end spot, okay? I mean, look, Josh Sweat is probably the leading candidate right now. I thought Deshaun Hall, I thought he had a great game yesterday, and I think he's a real runner. He should be fighting for it. Real good game for him. You still have guys like Sharif Miller, who you brought in. So there's going to be a real battle. Now that the Eagles bring a guy who's a veteran who had four sacks last year in to compete with those guys, he should help make everybody else better. You know, what do they say? Iron sharpens iron. And that's what I think about this trade. I think this is a sneaky good trade by Howie Roseman because Ryan Bates I like that I liked when they brought him in but we do we're stacked offensive tackle we got plenty of offensive tackles we got really good offensive tackles and he probably wasn't going to make this team now you send him to Buffalo and you bring in a guy who can possibly win the fourth or fifth defensive end spot in that rotation I think it was a great move I think this is a sneaky good move by the Philadelphia Eagles even if Eli Harold let's say Let's say he comes in, and even if he gets beat out by Hall, or he gets beat out by Sweat and Hall, okay? He, him being there he has to provide competition. We lost a lot when we lost Joe Osman, I think, to that ACL earlier this week. I mean, I think it really hurt us. And, and to get some more competition back in, and to get a, a veteran, a guy who's 25 and a vet, I like it. I like this move a lot. You know, I, I also got to say this. I, I also think that this tells you that the Eagles are, aren't really looking to bring in Connor Barwin. I don't think they want to bring him back because they could have done it already. He's been out there for a while, but what do they do instead? They make a trade. They bring in a guy who's 25 years old, who's on another team, who had four sacks last year, and I like it. I think this is a good move, a sneaky move for the Eagles. He is a decent player. He is definitely a guy who is worthy of the third or fourth defensive end spot on a team, okay? So to come in and fight with some of these young guys like Josh Sweat, uh, Hall and all those guys, Sharif Miller. I think this is a a good thing. Not like I said, not only just for 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 Eli Harold, but for the team, for the players that that have to compete against him. Let them all get better. That's what I say. So I'm giving this this trade a a. It's a sneaky trade, and I love it. I love it by the Eagles. With that said, let me know what you think in the comment section. Take care. Talk to you later. Don't be a dingbat.